All right. <clears throat> um, how can I say this without sounding like a dick? Um, first of all, I apologize for any language I'm, I might use. I'm not, and I very rarely use do that. But this is all based off of how I'm feeling right now. So, if anybody has a problem with that, I apologize, but this will be said. <clears throat> I currently live in Wisconsin. I have personally lived in three different areas so far this year. And guess what? Lately, it seems like players are just saying, Nope, fuck you. You can't get to them. You don't need to do them. And they're not saying it. They're being blatantly disrespectful. And again, I do apologize. You know, but this is, again, this is how I'm feeling. So if this offends anybody, I'm sorry. Let's see here. I've lived out on a county line area, in a county line area. I've lived in the Green Bay area and now I'm living in the Fox Valley area. Three different areas. Roughly around central to northeast Wisconsin. At all three areas. In the groups for Pokemon Go on Facebook. Blatant disrespect. Now, you know, I wasn't able to participate in Entei Raid Day. Because... Nobody fucking gave me a ride. Nobody would even say, well, I'll try. Nobody even said, no, I can't. Every time I posted something about needing a ride to do some of the raids with everybody. No one would even comment. No one would even look at the shit. And that's the part that's irritating the hell out of me. But yet... Niantic purposely made the friend function in Pokemon Go to get people to meet others and make new friends as well as getting off people's asses and getting out there and playing the game. When I was living out in the county line area, I'm just going to call it the county line area. That's the part that that's the area I lived out in the central part of Wisconsin. I was even being bullied by other Pokemon Go players. Yes, I said players. Um, I was in Green Bay. I stated I would like to go out and do any of the raids. You know, even saying, no, we can't do it. No, I can't do it. No, I can't do it. No, I have a pack car. No, I can't do it. You know, something that freaking simple makes a person feel like they're not being ignored. Could I get that in Green Bay? Hell no. Rikaza raid hour. Not long after the raid, not after Rikaza came back. Matter of fact, I think that was about two weeks ago now. I was in Green Bay. Think I had a single freaking person. Sit there and say, yeah, I'll pick you up so we can go do the raids. Nope. I even said, look, I want to get out and do the raids. Can somebody please pick me up so I can do the raids? Not a single freaking comment. Yesterday. Well, not yesterday. I think it was Wednesday or something. Yeah, when, yeah, it was Wednesday or some shit like that. Yeah, it was Wednesday. I asked this past Wednesday now. Keep in mind, this is this past Wednesday, the 14th of August. I had asked this. I, that, by the way, that last one was in the Green Bay NEW group. Now I'm in the Fox Valley group. Wednesday, I asked, hey, I would like to get out and do some of the raids. Could someone please pick me up so I could join in on the fun and do some of the raids? One person offered to pick me up. I messaged him back about two and a half hours before the raids before the raid started. 
Well, I didn't message you on my com. I replied to the comment like, "Hey, where do you want me to meet? Where do you want to meet me at? So I so you can pick. So we can go get these raids done." Think I got a single response from that? No, I waited two and a half hours to the beginning of the raid hour. Not one single letter of a reply to that. Today, Sweet Coon Raid Day. Chance at Shanty Sweet Coon. I posted in the Fox Valley group. Hey, I would like to get out and do the raids and have enjoy, jump, and join in on the fun. Can someone please pick me up and bring me to the raids? And bring me around to the raids? Not a single frickin' comment on it. At least last time I checked. But yet, there's all these other frickin' people that are sitting there saying, Hey, well, I want to, hey, can we start the raids here? Or, hey, can we start the raids there? Raids there? No. Not a single fucking one of them wants to fucking say, oh, yeah, we, well, hey, we can pick you up if you need it. Well, guess what? I post, I literally posted that status in the group. Let me see here. What time is it? Now? Yeah, I posted it at freaking 11 o'clock in the morning. It is currently 3.35 p.m. 25 minutes before the event is supposed to start. I still have not gotten a single freaking comment on it. Now, I mean, not even saying, no, I have a full car. No, I can't do this. No, I can't do that. Or I can't do it for this reason. No, I can't do it for that reason. You know, at least if I got a no, oh, eh, no, you know, I would at least not feel blatantly disrespected. And there's sure, and yeah, there's sure the status is, hey, I want to start the, hey, can I, can I, I want to start it right over here. Can we start over here? Or hey, who, or hey, can somebody make it over here for the beginning of the raid event? I want to start over here. I commented on both of them. Hell, if I had a ride, I'd, 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 I would love to have a ride so I could join in on the fun. But apparently, I mean, shit, that, that's too much to fucking ask. Too much to fucking ask anybody because nobody gives a fucking crap. Lately, here in Wisconsin, it seems like for Pokemon Go, all anybody cares about are themselves and their friends. And screw everybody else who they don't know. So, <laughs> I'm going to find out who the admins are for this group. For the Pokemon Go Fox Valley group. And I'm personally going to sit there and I'm going to have a talk with them. Through Messenger. And I'm going to say, look. When somebody sits there and asks. If they could get a ride so they could enjoy the rage too. And nobody freaking comments on it. Not even to say, no, I can't do it because of gas. Or no, I can't do it because of this. Or no, I can't do it because I don't have room. Literally, I just got a notification that I just had somebody comment on something that I posted on there. Literally, two minutes after I stated the last time, so 3.37. But yet, everybody's acting like they're better than everybody else. Everybody's acting like they don't give a shit. So I'm starting to be at the point where I'm about to leave Pokemon Go because other players seem to only think of themselves and their friends. So, to all you YouTubers that I send, that I want to try and freaking DM this to on Twitter, I hope y'all can at least bring this up and talk about it. Because this is starting to get ridiculous. I'm 30 years old. I've played damn near every Pokemon game that has come out. That's part of the actual main series of the games. And, I, and I'd and i love to get out and interact with people. But it's when people start showing common stupidity. And I, I'm going to define that real quick before I continue on with that statement. Common stupidity is the lack of common sense. So, But it's because of people that are show, just showing more common stupidity than anything. 
it literally makes it hard for me to play the game. Like ones, twos, and most threes I could do on my own, yeah. But fours and the legendary raids? Please, I can't even do those to save my freaking life. Because I can never get enough people to do a freaking raid. So you know what? I'm done. I'm at the point where I'm about to say, screw all the groups. If you really want to freaking get a hold of me to ask if I want to do a raid, fine, message me. I don't care.